Hello everybody. So today we're gonna play some flight simulator or pilot training flight simulator. I hope you enjoyed our video from yesterday, jailbreak. It was really fun. Unfortunately we were able to rob any stuff, which was unfortunate. So we're gonna just play some flight simulator today. So we're gonna be going to by the way, these are all islands in the simulator. So we're gonna go to Perth. Perth Airport. So, right. I have a lot of experience, exp hours on this. By the way, I changed to gold clothes. It's really cool. Alright. Let's see, where are we going to find? Airliners. Um, let's fly the 777. For Unite Air Canada. Alright, here's our triple seven Air Canada. We we'll fly into Greater Rockford today. Here's the engines. So we're gonna be preparing to prepare for takeoff. Here's the cockpit. Here's the cockpit. Triple Seven is my third favorite airplane behind the Concorde and the Boeing 747. By the way, what is your favorite airplane, guys? Comment down below. If it's Triple Seven or any other one from Boeing. Where's the cockpit? This is uh, they updated this like um, a year ago, so that's pretty cool. Here's these are in real life. These are General Electric G90 engines. I also fly the Concorde, but I don't fly that one very often because it's fast, you know. Take off. Thirty three of this, we're going to take off. We're gonna begin for takeoff procedures. I mean, takeoff, I mean, uh, procedures. Alright, let's begin takeoff. Here, you wanna see the gear tilt? Now we're at full power. Let's see, I wanna see the gear tilt. V1. Rotate. Here's the gear tilt. Positive right, gear up. Now we turn to the left. Autopilot is engaged. So we're in the air now. 
climbing almost a thousand feet into the air. Here, you want to see the gear tilt before. Here's the gear tilt. Here's the flaps. Alright, cruising altitude. Let me climb to 1,000 feet. Alright, we're at 1,000. Just stay at our cruising altitude. Let's turn. Let's turn the plane to the right, because you know, when we, when we make our approach, we have to make a steep left turn to get on with the runway. Twenty-seven knots at one thousand thirty-four feet. Oh man, the auto, the the um, air traffic controller at Greater Rockford will be offline. So that's too unfortunate because we're halfway there to the to to, to our destination. So these are flaps, spoilers, you know, the yoke, you know, all of that, guys. And engine thrust and our control services in the landing gear handle, you know, all that. the rudder pedals. I know I'm giving you a little bit too, but that's all right. We're almost to our destination. Almost there, guys. We should be making an approach in a few minutes. Just approach. Start making the flaps down to two, landing gear, um, I need flaps, so 
need to make our turn. So the runway is right there, so we had to descend a little. Alright, where's the runway? Oh no, I better not, we better not stall. Ooh, excuse me, guys. Uh, where is the runway? Okay, we're on direct. <coughs> excuse me, guys, again. Alright. We're on direct approach. Hopefully you, hopefully you guys think this runway is a butter landing. Triple seven begins its approach to the runway. It's flaps and gears now. Approach, just we need to turn, turn the aircraft a little bit to the left. Alright, we're getting closer to the runway. Oh wow. There is another blue that comes. Right. Almost there. Look at this count as butter, guys. Let's see. Landed. Land on the runway. Uh oh. Oh, that was a horrible, la horrible land ending. Alright, we arrived at GR at Greater Rockford Airport. So we need to taxi to the gate. Prepare for next flight. <laughs> Taxi to the gate and prepare for our next flight. Yeah, when you're flying Concorde, you don't use much fuel, but when you're on regular commercial airplanes, apparently you use a lot of fuel. It's kind of strange. Taxi to the gate. <laughs> By the way, guys, I'm going to Spain this weekend. I'll be there for two weeks. Flying Virgin Atlantic. 
to there and Air France back. We're going to Barcelona. We're flying from Atlanta to Barcelona, by the way, guys. I know a lot of you guys flew overseas, but it's my first time flying overseas. Which is very going to be a really good adventure. I'll try to make a video of flying overseas with Rouge Atlantic in Air France. The reason why we're going to Spain is because my mom's family is there. We're going to visit them, so that'll be really fun that adventure. Sadly, I'm not, I'm not sure what airplane aircraft we're flying. Oh wow, look at that fire thing. Alright, we'll have to refuel because we're going to go to Tokyo or Izurani. I hope you all like all these Roblox videos on this screen recorder because when I was doing the last video, I mean, like a few videos before, I did it like on my phone, which is a really long video. So hopefully you appreciate doing this screen recorder. Jets are flying around. Let's put flaps up because we don't need them anymore. ATC's back online again. Alright, let's start to the gate. So we can refuel, because we don't want to have an empty tank when we arrive at our next destination. Let's put fuel. I wonder why this fighter plane is crawling. Me. All right, let's put fuel. All right, here we are. Arrived at Greater Rockford. I don't know why this guy is here. Um, alright, let's check the airplane, make sure everything is in. Oh, here's the cabin, by the way. Everything is empty on this airplane. Except for the front. Uh, dude. Hold on, everybody. Uh, yes? Question mark? Yes. What do you want, man? Yes. Can I be co pilot? Uh, sure. 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 By the way, this guy wants to be a co-pilot, so I'll let him. Don't take my airplane away. Alright, let's check the engines. Alright, these are the engines. GEs. These are not GEs, but in real life they are. Here's the landing gear. Alrighty, so let's prepare for our next f flight, which is going to be going to Tokyo. I think Tokyo or Perth, back to Perth. Alright, let's contact GR Tower. GR Tower. Good morning. This is Air Canada. Air Canada. 
6090. Quest startup. Startup. Good morning, startup granted. Roger. All right. So ATC gave us permission. Here's our co-pilot, by the way. All right, bring in pushback. I think we're gonna go back to Perth. Request. Arrows, uh, kind of question. If I can find them. Alright, whatever. Let's see. CGR Tower. Which runway is. Which runway is available? Avail bubble for departure. Departure. Okay, this guy apparently wants to follow me. So wait a minute. Okay, we got. All right, let's begin takeoff. All clear. All right, let's go. So we're gonna take off from runway three six left, like the runway we came in. We came on eighteen left, eighteen right. I mean. All right, let's begin taxi to the runway. Look at this guy compared to my triple seven. He's just too busy, so I'm just gonna begin to taxi to the runway. Hold. Okay. Um Okay, what now? Is it safe? All clear, all right. Let's begin taxi to the runway. Uh oh, we have a SR seventy one Blackbird coming in. Okay, this guy is still in. Why is this SR-71 Blackbird to, in our way? I think he's gonna say, you're in the way of this Air Canada 777. Put flaps to one. Wait, wait a minute. Oh, let's put flaps to one. No, let's, no, just put them up. Flaps full. Flaps to two. Look at how many military airplanes. It's like a little mil. Go, f go fourteen. Why? Cause it's gonna run this guy over. Wait, stop. Stop, yeah, I see. Okay, I'm gonna find out when so I can friend request him. Runway 18 right is uh, available for takeoff. Um, where is he? So I can find him. Left. Why are you saying he's going left? I'm gonna go right. No. It's too- I'm gonna go to Perth, so I have to go that- okay, ignore him. Bye bye! No, bye bye, you sucker! No, you meant right. Uh, where is his name? Hold on a second. Where is his name? 
wait. Oh, uh, where is he? Where is he? Hold on. See, I can find him. Guys are gonna find a quest. All right, there we go. All righty, let's go. Clear. Let's keep going. Straight ahead. Alright, let's keep taxing, guys. So I have a lot of fuel on board. Alright, let's continue taxiing to the runway. Thirty six right. All right, let's continue taxiing to the runway. All right, let's continue moving to the left. Why are you saying right? You know he's saying it the wrong way. Alright. Alright, let's continue taxi. Wait, wait, let's get onto the runway. Hold on a second. Let's get full. Let me tell GR Tower. GR Tower. Let's see, am I clear for takeoff? Air Canada. Air Canada. 6090. Run him over. No, I'm not going to do that. No, no. No. Permission granted. Roger. Thank you. Thank you. Have a thank you. You too. Go. I was joking. All right, let's go. You know if you run me off. <laughs> All right, begin takeoff. All right, we're on the runway. Oh, you're using nice down 47. That's nice. Alright, take off. Positive right, gear up. Gear up. Alright, let's put the flaps up. Um, we're gonna make a turn to the right. All right, autopilot engaged. Autopilot engaged. Autopilot engaged. Alright, we're 
we're, on, we're cruising back to Perth. Where are we heading? Uh, Perth Airport. Alright, we're heading back to Perth, guys. Wait, if I'm co-pilot, that means I... Uh... Yes. This guy, this my co-pilot wants control. So maybe I'll give up control when we land. Or I'll just control the landing. Ask him if he wants control on the land. Okay, I'll give him control. Okay, we need to go to a higher altitude. I've done this. He wants to land, but he knows he's not sure. I I've done this route many times, if you don't know, because I started this game a long time ago. All right, we're almost to our destination, Perth Airport. So I have to turn autopilot off. We have to go higher because there's a mountain. Flaps. Flaps two. Let's see, prepare for landing. Yeah, tell them to prepare for landing. Let's see, Let's see, Getty. Let's see, ready to land. Ready to land. First officer. First officer. Alright, we're getting our approach to the runway. Yes, pilot. Oh, I'm gonna put our pilot on again so I can type. Okay. You should say captain. Alright, we go. Let's put the landing gears down. Alright, so the way to land when you're at Perth, you have to climb, and then you have to dive, because, or you have to dive, and then you have to line up for the runway. That's how you land when you're at Perth. I mean, there's another runway over there, but you have to, you have to turn to the left. I'll show you guys how I land there. Uh, Perth on runway 33. So let's turn to the left. Look that stall warning sound. And land. The runway is on. We have to climb. 40, 30, 20, 10. All right, dive. 
dive. Alright, we're now approached to the runway. Okay, we can't land that stall thing. Too high to the river of the ground. One hundred. Okay, hopefully I uh, hopefully you told me this landing is smooth. Fifty. Say so what? I'm sorry. reverse. Alright, we landed on the runway. Hope you guys think it was a butter. That landing. Let me ask how how was my landing? How was my landing, co pilot? How was my landing? Well, this guy didn't respond. Okay, there better not be an airplane behind us. Runway 33, that's that per that was just landing on that one. Alright, let's talk to the gate. Let's talk to the gate. Whoops, the wrong touch to the grass. Oof. What? Oh well, he's pro We're almost no. Or fuel. Let's see. I know. Yeah, these planes apparently, when you're flying 777, 747, 767, 767s, in this game, you lose a lot of fuel. But when you're on Concord, when you fly Concord, you don't use very much fuel. I don't know why, but that's very confusing. Alright, we had a taxi to the gate, and I think we're gonna end the video there. Or we can do another flight. So we just have a taxi to the gate. In around 9 minutes. <laughs> I was lucky I left. Usually when you're flying 777, it takes 7 minutes to fly from Greater Rockford to Perth. Or if you fly 747, it's about the same. But when you're flying Concorde, it's like 2 minutes, or 3 minutes, or 5 minutes. You know what I mean, guys. It's like flying from JFK to New York, uh, to JFK to Paris, or to London. It takes three hours to fly with Concorde while you're flying 777 or 747. It takes like seven hours or six hour flight. You probably will notice that because probably some of you guys took some of these flights with 777s or 747s. Yeah, look, we're losing. We almost have half a tank of fuel. So I think we'll have to park at the terminal because, you know. Alright, let's go a little faster so we can get there a little faster because there's no airplanes around. Wow. 
Why is saying it's AFK? By the way, I also have a lot of flight experience. I have like 2,040 minutes flying. I think you guys didn't know that. You can look up there if you want. So probably next two video, maybe tomorrow or Thursday, Wednesday, we will play Ultimate Driving or Driving Empire, if you will. That will be next video on my Roblox series. This will be posted on Beaver Aviation Triple Seven. You probably will see that Beaver Aviation Triple Seven. That's my channel, by the way. You probably you'll probably post it you probably see that when you put when I posted my jailbreak video yesterday. Didn't know. Alright, right, we're gonna park at the gate right here. And then we're gonna end the video. Back. What do you mean back? Gate 6. Stacks you to the gate. Alrighty, here we are at the gate, gate six. So we're gonna park. Gonna park right here. Let's park a little further in. Alright, here we are at the gate. Alright, here we are at the gate. Alright, let's... Alrighty guys, here we are at Perth Airport again. So, I'm gonna... Alrighty guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. I apologize if it's a little bit long. But, I hope you enjoyed the video. Subscribe! That'll help support the channel because I have one subscriber. So do it. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Subscribe. And I hope you have a very good day and a good night, guys. Bye. Peace.